Hi guys and welcome back to our tutorial series. In this tutorial I'm going to be teaching you how to make this simple pause menu. And I believe let's get started. <clears throat> uh, first thing you're going to do is you want to create a new JavaScript. So cl click on your FPS script folder and click on JavaScript and then name this pause script. Or pause alone would be alright. Now pause system. That's better. Now attach that to the player's body, the main body. And double click and open this in one develop. Right. You start with function start and update. Leave them for now. Let's just do the variables. The first one we're going to need is pause. Pose um, set, and this is going to be type boolean, and it's going to be equals to false. Next one's going to be for pose exit. It's going to be type <coughs> boolean. It's going to be equals to false, and the last one's going to be var pose texture it's going to be a time GUI style save and ok don't need start so get rid of that we need a new function GUI so function on with a capital O lowercase n Capital G U I. Open bracket, close bracket, open curly brace, close curly brace. Save this. Let's create the GUI first. We're going to say if open bracket, close bracket, open curly brace, close curly brace. Pause. Set equals equals true. Then Do something. I'm going to say GUI dot label dot. Nope, sorry. Open bracket. New rect. Open bracket. Close bracket. Comma. Close bracket. Closing semicolon. And over here we're going to say zero zero. We don't want to uh, position it anywhere. We want the width. Of this whole picture to be screen dot width and the next one's gonna be screen dot height then all we're gonna say is pause texture at the end so that's going to display the pause texture. Underneath this, we're going to say if open bracket, close bracket, open curly brace, close curly brace. Don't want to pee there. <laughs> that sounded wrong. Um, if pause set is equals equals to true. I better stop writing true like that. It's getting my nerves. Then we want something to happen. We're going to say if open bracket, close bracket, open curly brace, close curly brace, if GUI <coughs> dot button, open bracket, close bracket, closing semicolon, closing bracket one more time, and we're going to say new rect, open bracket, and we're going to say 10, 10, 150, 50. Just positioning it on the top left hand of the screen, making it 150 width and 50 height. I don't want a texture for it, there's no point. Just gonna put a little text inside. I'm gonna say exit menu. So exit 
because this is a simple one and I don't want to waste time and just make textures for this when we get to the real advanced pause menu I should make it properly so that's that done <clears throat> when we click on it we want to do something we're gonna say pause set equals false <clears throat> and um, that's it save now in the update we want to do something we're gonna say <clears throat> excuse me if open bracket close bracket open curly brace close curly brace if we press the escape key dot get key open bracket close bracket key code dot escape and if the pause set is equals equals to false so basically if we press the escape key and the pause set is false we want the pause menu to slow show up so we can say pause set equals tr true ah oh, come on like that so that shows the uh, pause menu and we want to say time dot time scale now this pose this is used for pose in unity also for slow motion and we're going to say equals to zero zero means uh, stop so it's uh, select posed one means back to its default value and anything in between it is slow motion and that's how you do that slow motion effects then we're going to say over here if open bracket close bracket open curly brace close curly brace <clears throat> no sorry I am mistaking myself delete that inside this as well I forgot to do one thing pause exit equals true <clears throat> and also this is not supposed to be post set it's supposed to be post exit no 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 it is post set and inside this we're gonna say if an open bracket close bracket close this bracket underneath the statement was inside this if pause exit equals equals true and then if we click on this we want to say time dot time scale equals one set it back to what it was before and then we want to say pause exit equals false and that's the pause menu done unless it finds an error put a double speech mark in this and then comma <clears throat> now the GUI texture I have already if you want it I'll upload it to the site so you can just download it it's a very basic menu texture pause menu right there and you want to apply this into the normal one and GUI texture so let's see what happens run the game Save your scene. Escape menu shows. <laughs> Exit menu goes. Brilliant, works. So if I show you something, if pause exit is false, see it goes away. You need it to be true in order to see the GUI. If it's true, it comes back. <laughs> and that's how you make a simple pause system, guys. Hope you enjoyed this. Uh, don't forget to rate, comment, subscribe, and I will see you guys next time.